now they don't. <laughs> now they just don't. It's it's really strange. Uh, it's a strange feeling for me. Okay, there we go. Um, yeah, what have I added? I've just added a bit of ambient stuff that we will need to make to like um, quests and locations and stuff. I, I've just added, I think here. Ah, look at this. Yes. <laughs> We've got now the Umbrella Mining Corporation with the correct logo. <laughs> this is the whole place here is, is driven from Umbrella. Um, I've added some ambient stuff here just so that we we, we can walk around. Um, we will need to change the cabinets because we can hide in those later on. Right. So you see I've made this more of a horror level-ish stuff. There's stuff there, there's stuff here, there's ambient stuff. Everywhere. There's props everywhere. I've also made a second area here. That is right now only open for testing purposes, of course. Uh, and in that area, we've got like a storage area where we will need to get stuff. We will need to get... Uh, I don't even know what it was. A key or something? Oh, no. Um, something to open the doors. And have been barricaded. Right here. So we cannot open these. We need to get a tool and that tool we will get out of the other room there. So let's fill it a little bit more with life. You see there's already quite a lot here in this area. I still want to add more. I don't know what yet, but I want to add more. And there's also this, em this area is almost completely empty. So according to the plan that we made uh, two weeks ago, I think, or sorry, I just ate. <laughs> uh, the, the plan that we made like two weeks ago, um, we've got the storage area, this one here. We will need to put cabinets where we can hide. Correct, I forgot about those. And we will also need to add like a key or a tool, a crowbar. I think back then we decided, let's use a crowbar. So all that stuff I need to put in there. Crowbar and cabinets to hide in. Uh, so let's just grab some cabinets actually. These are my hidey hidey holes. This one. that in the storage area here let's just put a couple here and there so we can hide in those I mean we cannot hide in those yet but we will we should be able to at some point I should have made a new prefab before doing this I should definitely make a new prefab yeah before I continue with this I will make it a new prefab Yeah. How many did I use already? One, two, three. Okay, that's easy. Those though. No. Yeah, if I don't make those prefabs, I will have problems later on because I have to manually adapt all of them. No, I want them to all to work in the same way. So I will have to make those um, all the same prefab. Oh, there's four. There's one in here as well. That makes sense. Mm, let's maybe put that outside. Boink. Let's put two here. Ah, I want to make it a prefab anyway. Hi, Goofy King. Ha ha. Wait, why do I not have things open? Just give me a second. Okay, that's good. There we go. That's all I want to do. Almost nothing. Yeah, so there's still many, many things to do in this. Uh, I'm the best. <laughs> Thank you. I'm probably not. I am pretty sure it's scientifically proven that I'm not the best, but uh, thank you. <laughs> so those things here, they need to become um, prefabs. I'm cool. I, I would say I'm nerdy, but thank you. <laughs> yeah, with the glasses. I've got a slight headache, so I need to put those on. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I need them to see. They are really in my like like they replace my normal glasses I've got here. Um, I need them to see right now. Let's replace all the cabinets here. Let's make it a new prefab. <laughs> I'm good at laughing. <laughs> What's that even supposed to mean? Uh, well, thank you. Um. I'm not good at laughing. I'm just honest about it. If I find something funny, I just laugh. 
Uh, let's make that a new prefab. Let's give it a good name. Uh, cabinet hiding. Let's make a new one. Boink. Done. That's it. That's all I needed to do. And now I can just replace. Uh, put multiple out there. One goes here. Uh, boink. Ish. Yeah, that's okay. One goes here. One goes over here. But the music is actually decent. I thought the music would just suck because it's copyright free. Uh, well, it's decent. As usual, most of the times the music's still okay. So, okay, that goes here-ish. There we go. So later on we can hide in those. Right now we can't do anything, but later on we can. Good. Changing room done. Now I just want to spread a couple of those bad boys. That's not the thing I wanted to grab. That's the whole room. That's the one. What's the best emoji? Uh, wait, I've got... Wait, the best emoji is this one here. <laughs> I'm sorry. Wait, how do I... How do I close this again? I'll close. I want to just see my chat again. Yeah. <laughs> You see that emoji? That's my, that's me. <laughs> that is my emoji, that's the best. I've got more, I've got more. <laughs> Wait, this one has a background. Oh, I messed up this one. <laughs> oh yeah, the poop emoji is also great. Show more. I only have two more and one I messed up. One has a background I have to replace. So let's place more cabinets here, just for hiding's sake. One goes here. <clears throat> oh, my voice just cracked. It's strange to hear my voice. Usually I don't hear my voice, but now my headset is set in such a way that I hear it. It is really strange. I'm not gonna lie, it's really strange. Wait, why am I on Twitch? Why do I still have this category? Oh my god, Twitch, I have the wrong category. Uh, science and technology. There we go. Whoopsie. Let's put one here and one over somewhere else. Just here in the back. I don't know why, but we need cabinets here in the back. Do we need one? Yeah, no, let's put it right next to the to this place here. He's so hot, right? Isn't he? Hi, Dr. Mac. Do you or did you already finish classes? How, how was classes today? I wanted to go into the um, what's it called? Into the Teams meeting, but I was also now. Why would I? Yes, sir. Very good, very good. You finished. Yeah, multi streaming, there's some delay, so interacting is quite difficult. Sorry. Pretty good. That's that's good. Hi, Mad Noob. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, we've made a lot of progress, actually. Look at the no definitely not copyrighted uh, logo and stuff. <laughs> it's good. If the class today was, was good, that's great. Yeah, handsome and hot and cool. Yeah, definitely things. That's definitely how my friends would describe me. 100%. There is actually much more in the game already, yeah. I'm just putting... Right now I just wanna... Be, I'm just streaming because I I usually program like this time of the day. I take some time to, to do some progress on personal projects. Um, at the end, I don't need to correct them. I have the results. Like the results directly popped up yesterday. Already while you were taking it. Um, I just have to look through if I can still... There's maybe one or two that ha that are like at 48 or something, and I, I might find some points to squeeze in like a pass still. That's what I. That, that's that's me taking time, but I'm basically done with that. Yes. But more to that tomorrow. So that's where we can hide. Yeah, I'm a nice guy. 
<laughs> what do you think? That I just go like, nah, screw them. No, that's not. That's not really me. I don't know what these metallic things you do, but it's kind of a storage area here, so let's put them all together. That was wrong. This one. Uh, what? What's this one? What's this one here? Oh, it's there. Boink. But yeah, it's good. If the class today was, was good. I don't know. I, I never really did. I, I had, I also had the scientific work stuff in my studies. I never really used it. It is pretty helpful, I, I gotta say, but I never really used it in reality. Let's bring everything. Sorry for chewing gum. That's very rude. I'm sorry. Uh, wait. Yes, I've got this just set up for, for such incidents. Uh, there we go. I'm back. I just, I just took out my, my chewing gum. But you don't need to see that. That would be rude. Uh, so what else do we put in? So this is a storage, storage area. Like, um, not just, yeah, mainly storage. But like, this is a mine. All of this is a mine. And we've got uh, like those lores. Are those called lores in English as well? I think so. Loren. Those mining wagon thingies. And... Basically, here is the, is the place where we put in everything that comes from the mine. So I kind of want an area that looks like this to have anything. Let me see. Copyrighted. What's the copyrighted? Okay. Uh, downloaded, I think. Antlers? No. I just want this area to look a little bit like industry, industrial machinery, uh, some stuff going on there a big boiler uh, like big shelves like this is good I mean this shelf storage stuff goes all on this side yes that's perfect so all of this is like a storage area here with different areas like this is for for gas and liquid we will get we will have to get some gas here later on um i just thought about that and we will have like a storage area here just something like this and then we can just walk here yeah that makes sense let's put like three of those Big Shelf. I love that it's called Big Shelf. Um, yeah, let's make it a couple of rows here. And then you have to search. You have to search for something in those. And while you search, there's this, uh, there's the spiders following you. That's appropriate, I think. Let's make one more row. That's okay. Let's actually then take the liquid stuff here and rotate that first. Get the cabin. I'm still thinking about the layout of the room. Uh, <laughs> hey, Goofy. No, that's just my green screen. Wait, you can actually see something that you shouldn't see. Uh, no, that's just my green screen. I'm not in the school right now. I'm at home. Yeah, I'm... No, I'm not in class. What is this? this thing? No. It's not my green screen. Oh, my green screen doesn't... does cover the whole area. No, it does. Yes, it was shifted a bit. <laughs> but no, I'm, I'm just at a home. And behind me, this is just... Uh, that's why if I go face cam... I can actually not see anything in the background because that's where my that's where my void is. I live in a void and that's where it is. <laughs> change it to a beach. <laughs> I don't have a beach picture. I could I could easily change it. I don't. Ah, uh, let's let's see. 
the problem is those pictures are usually copyrighted and stuff. It's not too easy to change. Uh, beach. Images. And let's search for something not copyrighted. Uh, tools. Uh, Creative Commons. Nice little beach. Which one? Which one looks nice? With a sunset? Maybe the one with the sunset. Let's take this. Ah, uh, licensable. Ah, uh -huh, most of those are licensable. Hmm. License, license. Why do I... If I select... Don't give me license stuff. Fascinating. Yeah. Why does it give me... Oh, because they are licensable, but they have the comments license. Okay, that's okay. I can take that then. Wikimedia comment. What is Wikimedia Commons? Uh, from Wikimedia Commons, the free media repository. Yeah, it'll give me. Hello, Steph. Hi. Uh, beach. Let's put that in here and then in my folder OBS. There we go. Boink, boink. And now I can just change it to that beach. Give me a second. You're right. I always wanted to change it because the classroom makes sense because I'm a teacher, but <laughs> I also don't really like it. A duplicate. And let's make that a different picture. And that is the beach. There we go. Boink. one here right yeah well it's not really a beach but kind of close enough close enough now now i feel like i'm on vacation a little bit <laughs> that's actually way nicer thanks for the hint it's way nicer there we go i'm on a beach now <laughs> so Ah, uh, yeah, we've got all the cabinets here that we need to search for. I am having fun. Yeah, sure. I'm always, I'm, I'm usually always having fun. It's pretty rare that I do not have fun. So this is, if the spider attacks us here, we can just hide in it. I wonder if we can still, still squeeze through here. Probably can. Uh, I want to take these and rotate them and put them again. Ugh. Against the wall. Nope, wrong thing. Boink. Uh, like this. Let's put them against the wall. Yeah, I like it. This is okay. So, yeah, this is just a huge storage area. Let's see how it feels like. It probably does feel kind of nice. Um, let's see. So we can go in here, and then we're like, oh, there's huge cabinets. There's stuff here. And this is where we, we could hide in this one. Okay. We can walk around here. I can even see through those. Like, it. Oh, they have kind of shitty uh, colliders. But I gotta fix that. That fits okay. And we've got this here in the end. That's okay, I can even see everything without with my glasses on. <laughs> it's just strange. Um, those things, why do they have... I mean, yeah, it makes sense. They've got mesh colliders. I will keep them as mesh colliders. I mean, we can now kind of jump into them. Just stupid. That's okay. That's okay. Let's see. Let's see how it feels like. Hi, it's that. Hi. I mean, no, we can't really go into them. That's okay. Wait, I've got my sounds. Wait, why do I have my sounds? Uh, there we go. Uh, hi. Welcome to the internet, your gateway to adventure. <laughs> so, 
I like this way more with having like the beachy in the background. I like this way more than the classroom. Thank you. Feels like small vacation. No, it's, it's still the same thing that I've been programming on the last two months, I think. Hey, yo, was geht? Lukas, was geht? <laughs> it's still the same thing that I've been working on for the last... I think it's really two months. Three months now? Four months? Almost four months now. Um, I'm only programming once a week, so... We haven't finished yet. I mean, this is just one level. The level looks way different than the rest we had already. Okay. That feels okay. Okay. I like it. We need to get some gas then here and... Yeah, that's okay. Good, 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 good. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Um, is this just one here? Yeah, this is just one huge object. Ah, silly. Okay. Um, I think the next thing would be to... Let's make some animations. I don't... Uh, I'm just going by... By my gut. So the next thing I want to do is just some easy, simple animation. That easy, simple animation is on those cabinets here, right? We want to open and close them, of course. Uh, so let's give this thing here an animation. Blah. Just touch something. I, I, I read most of the questions that are put on my YouTube videos, but I haven't... I don't remember them all the time, and I cannot answer all of them. Just ask here. Just just shoot. Put my microphone away a little bit. Maybe I can't yell there. Yeah, this is the mine area. Yeah. We've got a spider as the enemy, as the as the monster that's following us. Uh, that's why there's spider webs already in this area. I still have to finish this area as well. Um, yeah. That's it. <laughs> Um, animations. So this thing needs an animation. We need to open and close it, of course. Which door we open? Uh, always the left one. We always open the left one. So this one will get an animator. Animation? Is animation okay? Animation is okay, right? Yeah. Play automatically? No. Uh, no, it needs to be... Let's do this. Let's, let's do it the correct way. Uh, we can. I selected down here. You can select animation for every object. Now I can do here uh, to make to create uh, to begin animating cabinet hiding. Create an animator and an animation clip. So I click. I just click create, and this will create this thing here. Uh, do I already have quests? Oh, this is the first thing. The first thing that that does something in the mines love it uh what do they call it quest let's say let's make this quest 30 mine inside let's make a quest 30 quest 31 let's call this cabinet hiding uh, and now I've got this this animator that has been added, and I will do apply that to all the to all the other cabinets. It has now the um, animation in it, and I just need to make the animation. I can just press. It's hard. why am I even? Ex I we're not here for learning, but I will still push my face somewhere else so you can actually see it, what I'm doing. <laughs> down there, uh, down there, I can now click on this record button. And this record button now records everything that I do. So if I take the door and I say, um, insert keyframe, where's insert, oh, no. I don't need to do anything. Uh, I just need to select how fast does it happen? How long does it take to open the door? Let's say one second, 
does it take one second to open the door? So at one second, I will just rotate the door now. Um, whoops. Like this. And then we go in. That is another second. And then we close the door again. Well, basically, that's... No, that is fast. No, no, no that's another second. Oh, that closed already a little bit. And then another second. So the whole process takes three seconds. And then we close the thing again. Okay, zero. Done. That's it. So if I press play now, you will see the door can open and the door will close again. And that is how you make simple animations. Later on, I can just say in the uh, in programming, please run that animation. That's pretty easy. What do you mean test? What do you write test? Wait, let me put my emojis there. What do you mean test? Hmm? 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 <laughs> uh, yeah, the animation works. That's okay. And the other cabinets, because I made it a prefab. This cabinet here, for example, should also have the same animation. There we go. Got it. I could have made two animations, one for opening and one for closing. Maybe I should have. I don't know. It's okay. It's okay. That's that. No, it's okay. Two. It's 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 just one animation. That's okay. So all the others, even this one here, that's completely in a different room, should have the same animation. Perfect. So let's do the same with this door here. Uh, but the alarm series. Will you continue? Uh, probably not. But if you need to know something, ask. Hi, electric electric speedruns. Uh, I'm good. I'm good. I've got a slight headache. Hence, I'm wearing my <laughs> my my shades. Not to not to look cool. I know I do, but I I wear those because I have a slight headache. Um, let's also take this door here that I cannot touch, as you can see. Whoops. Uh, which is in the storage area. We've got the barrier and I've called that, I think, door. It's untouchable because I have it on the layer, uh, layer environment. Let's actually change it back to default. So I can always touch it. Mm. Let's put an animation here as well. Okay. So the door will have, um, will open and close. So let's give this door here the same as we did. Select it, we go to animations and we create an animation clip. And let's call that one storage door. Open, no, storage door. Open. Storage door. Oh, I get it. I get the naming now. I was wondering. Storage door. And let's call that storage door. Open. This will get two animations. No, actually, we'll just have one. That's okay. We'll still call it storage door open. Because this is the animation we want to run to actually open the door. And we, if I run it in the negative time space, it will just close again. Uh, I'm just wondering if I open both doors or just one. I think we just open one door. Let's record this. Let's actually say this takes a second again. And let's say this opens like maybe this. That's okay. Uh done. That's maybe a little bit more, it doesn't matter. Done. So play the animation, you see the door opens. If I now run the animation in a negative time space. It will also close again. So that's what I have to do later on in the programming of it. I should have done that with the other door as well. Doesn't matter. Okay, we've got those two animations. 
We will have to find a crowbar here, so I will need to download like a crowbar. Um, as a, wow, that music is pumped up. That's better. A sunny day, not. Hi, Gina. Hi. Wait. Hi. By the way, later on today, in, in the evening time today, maybe you've seen it, I will stream uh, Factorio. I hope we finish Factorio today, but that is later on. I, I still want to do at least one, maybe one and a half hours of programming. You see the animation is not running right now because I have set it to not automatically start. Which makes sense. We need to make it interactable um, and that's it then. I cannot remember how my interactables work. Shit. Hmm. Does it? It loops. I don't want those to loop. Can you activate outputs in PLC Zim tier portal? Yes, of course. What do you mean? Physical outputs like on the real PLC? No, but of course, normal outputs you just um Depends on the simulation you use. PLC Zim uh, for 1500s, I, I, I assume, the new PLC Zim. Yes. You just click on them. They have a little square and you just click on them and then they activate. Uh, the thing is, you have to have, exclamation point, those outputs in your hardware configuration. If you do not have those outputs in your hardware configuration, it won't work. You have to have them in your hardware configuration. Maybe that's why it's not working in your case. Okay, let's uh, get a crowbar. There's probably a crowbar for free in the store, so let's let's check it out. I'm pretty sure there is. That's like a standard component that you find in almost every second game. Uh, crowbar. There we go. Oh, we've got plenty of crowbars. Some of them cost money, some of them don't. Um, I just want a really simple, that's just one free crowbar, are you kidding, there's a, there's a tool pack. I don't want a tool pack, I just want a crowbar, give me the crowbar. Uh, I still like the programming, no, no. There's other issues that limit me from uh, doing programming tutorials on that topic. I'm still doing Unity programming. <laughs> Where I haven't done a video in, in a couple of days now. Uh, I will do one, not tomorrow, but on Thursday. Where we talk about the saving, which is like saving and loading, which is an important process. So now I should have a crowbar here if I reload my packages. And don't sort them by name because C is definitely not the first, um, the first letter of the alphabet. Crowbar. It probably doesn't work with my um, with the HDRP with the render pipeline that I'm using. But that's okay. Oh no, it does. Interesting. Uh, import. Let's go. Let's put that in the correct folder already. Uh, let's take the crowbar. Where is it? In here. Model textures miscellaneous? Crowbar, there it is. Is that the correct thing? That's that's the one I want. Kind of, that's too small. And where's the textures and stuff? What's going on here? Is there prefab? No, there's just the model. The model is the prefab. Why do you call it model if that's the prefab? That doesn't make any sense. But okay. Uh, let me just do one thing. This material here, I have to, because it's purple, you see. Purple indicates that it doesn't work with the stuff. Hey, Shade Singer, sorry <laughs> you're eating. Yeah, I'm sorry, I've got a slight headache. That's why I'm wearing those. Yeah, I'm on vacation, as you can see. No, I'm working. Uh, hi, Yellow the Arctic Wolf. Hi, Rox. Um, no, I've just got a slight headache. That's why I'm wearing those. Um, yeah, I need to update the materials. As you can see, it's purple, but I got to go uh, somewhere. Where is it? Uh, I always mix it up where it is. Window? 
no. Tools, no. Component, no. Game object, no. Asset, no. Edit, yes. Render pipeline, there we are. Uh, upgrade materials. Upgrade selected material to HD material. Yes. Yes. This should fix the crowbar. It takes a second. There we go. It's definitely fixed and not just still not working. Bumped specular. Whatever bumped specular is. Uh, uh, let's make it manually. Sure. Why not? I don't care. Boink. Uh, boink. Um, normal map there. Boink. Done. That should be fixed now. There we go. Model. Now this is a prefab. If you do something good, correct. I mean, thanks for whoever uploaded that for free. I'm not complaining. <laughs> I, I just did, I know, but no, I'm not complaining. So we've got this crowbar now. Um, the sunglasses are just because to limit the amount of headache because I've got a light on. Maybe you see the... Maybe you see the reflection of my ring light in my glasses there. And that light is really bright. If I turn this light off, you will see what happens. <laughs> yeah, I'm, uh, it's like this now. <laughs> it's pretty dark in here, so uh, now I could take off this, the shades because the, 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 the light is not burning my eyes out. But I can't stream, and not, at least not properly. It's for compensating the light, not my headache. It's not. It's helping me to not get a worse headache. That's what they do. Uh, let's put the. I, hi, Gordon. Hi. I didn't just. I didn't fart. It was my chair. If you if you just heard a fart sound, it was me. <laughs> it was my chair. Uh, I swear. I swear it was me. <laughs> um, back to the standard screen here. Yeah, so we've got the crowbar. Let's put that somewhere in some of those. We need to find it. I want to... It's hidden in one of those things here. And, and hidden, I mean it's just sitting there. Rap video. <laughs> yeah, I should... No, I should not do that. <laughs> I mean, maybe, but actually, no. Let's put it on the second floor, on the second level here, because that is where the... Um, player might look maybe too small but I don't care it looks stupid now that everything here is empty but I would put boxes and stuff just in a minute ah oh, god damn it the doors are closed right I forgot uh, let's open the door which side did I yeah okay this one so let's uh... Let's just open it. Yeah. So we could hide in here, but we can't right now because it's not interactable. Uh, it's the same, Steph, I, I understand. It's the same for me pretty much. But, I'm doing this now. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, shitty trouble with tier proing this week. My tutorial saved your ass, Gordon. I'm happy they did. <laughs> I am happy they did. That's pretty cool. Let's put boxes in here. I want like just simple storage boxes. And then I'm gonna fill all those cabinets with stupid stuff. And there's the crowbar in between that stupid stuff. So let's do it. Take a pill for headache. I really... No, it's not that bad. Like, I can really compensate with this. I can really compensate with just wearing glasses right now. Um, and some tea. And some tea. I don't like to take pills all the time. It's not... It's not making your body go better at all it's just temporary and in the end you you get like an immunity you need more of that stuff and i don't really like doing it 
It's not the worst you could do. Uh, but I, I, it's not necessary. That's that's what I'm saying. It's not it's not yet necessary. Red has to pick it up. Yeah. Uh, I'm not. Yes, you're right. But I'm not. Uh, I'm not using Ray casts yet. I wanted to change to Ray cast, but what I simply did uh, for picking up, because I had to make the decision: do I use Ray casting or do I do anything, something else? I like Ray casting, but I also made. Uh, but in this case, I made the following. Uh, where is it? Um, this thing here. Basically, this. Basically, you're always looking. This is what you always have in front of you. And this is the area. That it's just it's an object. Basically, you have an object in front of you, and that is the thing that decides if you can pick up. I'm. I haven't used ray casting. I'm using a collider. Yeah. Uh, reset. No, not reset. Yeah, reset. The other is way more efficient if it comes to. Um, if it comes to calculation and power and, and what you can do with it. And now one problem that I have with this is that I can grab through walls, basically. Because the collider goes through walls, I have a script that actually tells me it, it just calculates the first component that hits. Which leads to other projects. So, so it's quite complex already what this does. Um, but it's it's just another method. It's not the, the, the ray casting is probably the better. But I've used this for some reasons I I, I forgot it's so long ago. <laughs> so, um, we put boxes. And also for picking it up, I could just not use the mesh renderer, which, which I actually don't want to. Uh, which, not renderer. Uh, oh, it doesn't have a collider. It does not even have a collider. Uh, I would just make a box collider. And then with ray casting, it would not be a problem because I just make this. All right, something like this, and then it's just bigger, the pickup area, so I'm f that's fine. There we go. Yeah, you can also do that. It's not, it's, it's, it's definitely not the better way. Use ray casting. If you're using ray casting, use that. I wouldn't recommend what I did, but I did it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't know why, but I did. Look at now the crowbar has this huge ass pickup area. So let's put boxes. Do I already have some kind of boxes? Box. What is that box? And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going just gonna put a couple of things in those cabinets. Just unsorted. It's just really unsorted the whole thing here. I don't want it to feel empty, right? Now it feels just empty. Don't like it. So this gotta take a minute. <laughs> right, let's put another one somewhere. There. Uh, let's make that a bit smaller. Uh, it's pretty much there's a lot of content actually It's still the same thing. I, I barely work on it like every week, maybe two three hours. So it's actually Not that much <laughs> turtle. <laughs> let's put a turtle here <laughs> No, let's not Yeah, those boxes look at those those are good I want to put a couple of those everywhere Um, thing is, game development just takes a shit ton amount of time. I'm not gonna lie, I thought I would be done 10 years ago. And yeah, I just want to put a lot of those boxes now, because that's just, it's just a storage area and those belong here. But it's gonna take a couple of minutes. But don't you worry, it will not be worth it. <laughs> in 
And there's e not even anything in those. Oops. And I don't know how much longer I will invest in this in, in making this game. Uh, I want to finish it. That's that's the thing. I don't want to stop before I'm finished. The thing is, I don't know how much longer that will be. So we have a little box. Little box sounds nice. Little box. Little box. Little box. That's a little box. Are you kidding me? That's a huge box. Kind of strange music. I just it's the same playlist I used last time and I'm like I have no idea what that is. Little box they say, yeah sure. It starts looking like a like a storage area. Not perfect, not sorted at all or anything. It's just like a storage area there where you find stuff. And then you're just gonna find, and you're like, ah, I don't know what any of this is. And then you're like, oh, frick, a crowbar, nice. Nope. Yeah. Gotta go. See you another time. Bye, my friend. Bye bye. Oh, an open little box. Look at this. Maybe put the crowbar in an open box? No. Okay. Morg? Morg box? <laughs> what the shit is this? That's huge. I kind of want it. I kind of want to put it somewhere. Let's put some here. We just go into the wall as well. Oops. I don't know. It's a morgue box, so there's dead bodies in there, but I mean, it could be anything. Doesn't matter. Here we go. Let's put one more. I like it. Whatever it is, I'm just filling this room with life right now. Or death, as those are morgue boxes. <laughs> uh, yeah. By the way, I'm not gonna stream for long. I just want like may maybe half an hour or so uh, for from now. Uh, but I'll be back in the evening and we will try to finish um, Factorio, Tiny Box. Hey there, Tiny Box Tim. <laughs> there we go. Hey, look at this. Hey, pur 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 savage, pure savage. Hi. There's this German rapper, which I... what He's probably my favorite German rapper. I haven't heard anything in years from him, but... Probably still my favorite German rapper. Uh, his name is Kul Svash. You just reminded me. I should listen to some... His songs are fantastic. Like his raps, his early... His early raps are really good. I don't even know if he hasn't renamed himself or something. Probably has by now. I think that's the last box that we have. We can also leave a couple of those empty. That's okay. Uh, so I put a big one over here as well because that looks too empty. Okay. Then we just go around and we try to find something. And then we see crowbar. Nice. Probably hard to see or something, but. Ooh, I know what to do. Um, this thing will also get, and here is where it gets interesting, an emission. <laughs> hey, SB, there is an end. There is an end, probably. I don't know. <laughs> As long as it works and it annoys me not too much, it's fine. But there is an end to it, definitely. I already did like two streams on Twitch only. 
So there's already been some content that has not been on YouTube. So, yes. Uh, let's check out something because right now it's just dark. Um, I want this to have some emission. How do I give this emission? <laughs> With HDRP, I don't know. Yeah, they were Twitch exclusives. Exactly. Where do I have this? Where, where is this from? There. Whoops. There. Can I also get that and put it into the emission? Yes. Then give this like a slight emission, like a greenish tone. Reddish? That might be too strong though. Oh, there. No, this doesn't change. Okay, this doesn't change. Anything. I have to check out something. I have. To, I don't really know how this works. Is it like this? Then it is kind of glowing. I know this is not exactly how it should be, but maybe it looks okay. So we walk around and we don't have any idea what's going on. And we're like, what's any of this? What's this shit? What's that bullshit? And you're like, hey, what's that there? I can see something. And then you're like, oh, nice. Yeah, that's okay, I would say. Kind of unfortunate that we can already see it from a distance without having the light on, but that's okay. I like it. It's okay. Maybe a bit less glow. Let's make it less glow. How how do I how do I do less glow? <laughs> uh, exposure weight. There we go. Let's make it 0 0.6, which is a little bit... It's its not that strong anymore. Still glowing, though. It's okay. I think. I don't know yet. Let, let me see. Yeah, we see something in the distance. It's like, what is this? What is this? And then we just go there, and then we're like, oh, crowbar. And then we can pick it up. That's okay for me. Yeah. But sometimes we can climb those. It's If we're in the right angle, ah, it's okay. Okay. This feels okay. This, this is a good storage. A good storage. A good, nice little storage area that we have. And also the living quarters here, living quarters, like the workers' quarters, the break room. Let's call it a break room. Also feels nice. It's okay. Okay. Good. Next. Is, I want some, like, hairspray stuff or something. Some hairspray stuff. Hey! <laughs> Wait, why didn't my Twitch bot do, say hi or something? Welcome to everyone that's new in the Discord. Why didn't the bot say anything? Um, there we go. Why did... That's the only task I have given my bot, uh, that the only thing that the bot should do is just say hi, but that's the only thing he doesn't do, as it seems. <laughs> okay. Uh, why are all of these things... Oh, they are now in this area. They need to go to the storage area. Boink. <laughs> um, there we go. Was dein Techniker? Ah, dann viel Glück, viel Erfolg auf jeden Fall. <lacht> yeah. Good luck on that. You are very welcome. 
Okay, so... <laughs> Wait, now you're doing that in Twitch and on... on wow, and in Discord. Whoa, that's crazy. Um, I've got both open, though. <laughs> Let's put the next thing that we can check... Wait, uh, next interactive... Next animation. I forgot the doors. You also need an animation. Whoopsie. Um, they are the same door, so theoretically, I can just... Theoretically, it should work if I just do this. And that is called bathroom door, then. Where did I put it? Quests, mine inside. Bathroom door. Uh, let's add the animation. It also takes one second to open this door. And then the door will go to the inside. It opens to the inside. Yeah, sure, why not? Like this. And done. Animation done. There we go. Okay, good. That's perfect. The animator is active and we add that to door. So now that should work. The only thing that is a problem here is that it's looping. Let's see if the other door also has it now. It should have it. Doesn't. Why does it not... Wait, why does the bathroom door not have it anymore? Wait, I did it on the door. Ugh. Uh, can I just drag that and put it on the door door? No. Mm. Shit. Oh, things in general. Uh, what do you mean in general? Things are... Okay, like, nowadays if you say things are good, um, it is probably not, you can't say that anymore. <laughs> things are okay. It's not like, I'm getting bored, not bored, but do you get that feeling nowadays of that void? There's nothing going on. Nothing is changing. You're just sitting at home and that, it's kind of annoying, but it's okay. It could be definitely be worse. I am doing fine. I'm definitely doing good, um, but I slowly also get the thing of what uh, of like every day is the same thing. Make asset could not be deleted. Make sure it's not in. What? It's down here, but I don't. Yeah, I know. Just delete it. Just delete it. Delete it. Do I have to restart the tour? Maybe I have to. Oh, delete. Yes. Hook on them like a loaded DLL, for example. Shit. Did I mess up? I probably messed up. <laughs> no, that's okay. Uh, I don't know. Uh, whoopsie. I think I broke it a little bit. Save, yes. Oh, whoops, cancel. Uh, I think I just have to restart the program. I hope. I mean, it does. It wasn't even really broken. That's okay. The neighbors from hell, OST. No, it's just some random ass copyright-free music from, uh, from, <laughs> from, what's it called? Uh, but Spotify. Neighbors from hell. Neighbors from hell tells me something. That has been like, that's not been really popular here. I think. Is that where you... They, they just interviewed people from... No. That's a game. Ah, oh, that's so old. That is really old. I remember. I, I haven't played it, but I remember it. Ah, that is so old. What was this? What was the pop-up there? Ah, uh, bathroom door. I hope I can delete it. There we go. I can delete it now. Sometimes things get stuck. 
I don't like it. It's okay. Here you go. So, uh, toilet, ceiling, door. Give me the door. Yes. The door should have an animation. Yes, please. Let's give that a name. I just have to do it new because I, I put it in the wrong place. Bathroom door open. Let's make that one second. Let's record it. In that one second, let's rotate it. Not like this. This here. That is dubstep. I don't really like dubstep. <laughs> yeah, uh, usually I display my chat here. I'm sorry. Usually I display my chat from YouTube here in... Um, on the stream, but I forgot to turn it on. There, there it goes. And there is the chat box now also on uh, the stream. I just forget forgot to turn it on. Oopsie, my bad. Now if you write something it should actually pop up on my stream. <laughs> right there. Uh, if it's on YouTube or on Twitch, actually. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> uh, good, okay, animation is done. Let's see. Play. Boink. Boink. Easy peasy. Uh, and that animation should not be in the prefab yet. Let's turn the animator on. Let's add that to the prefab. Uh, let's check the other door. That should have this now as well. Let's see. Boink. Done. Good, okay. The only thing, as always, uh, bathroom door open, that's not loop, done, safe, perfect. <clears throat> yeah. So you see, that is why it's taking also so long to make this whole thing. It's so many small details, like making those small, small animations, making, doing stuff, it's just crazy. It's just so much work. Uh, box, 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 tiny box, tiny box, lower. there we go, L goes in the storage area. Yeah, the next thing I want is like a, how's it called? Like a fire thingy, uh, a lighter? Is it a lighter? I think a lighter. Let's see. Uh, so I will also try to get and download one. Or lighter. Lig, lig. Yeah, I just want a lig. Durr. There we go, a lighter. Boink. Can be a cheap ass, I don't care. I mean, I would like to have a nicer one than this, but that's okay. PBR? Oh, fine. Why not? I don't care. That's okay. Like, this this one is okay. Um, I just need a lighter that we just carry around, and then we... Uh, th that's the first item we find. And what I also need is, like, hairspray or something. Spray. Like a can, yeah, something like this. Body spray, yes. Perfect. Yeah, so we, we will use the lighter and the body spray to just spray like, like a flamethrower. So that's the thing, we've got the lighter, we've got the hairspray, we need a key, kind of. Uh, we've got the crowbar. I think those are the items that we basically need in this area. Let's let's check. So we've got this plus, which is the lighter. Yes. We've got no other plus here, so no item. We've got a plus here. That is the key to the storage area. So I need to add a key. And then here we have the crowbar. And those are the items that we find. Oh, and the hairspray. Yes. Those are the four items we can collect here. So I need a key. I already have a key asset, but I, I actually don't like how it looked like. I've got this one here. Rusty key. Yes, that one. That's the one. That's the one. This music is uplifting. I like it. 
I don't know the beat yet, but I'm just humming. So let's add all the prefabs because I need to use them all. Why would that have a sample scene? Come on. <laughs> Use this. That's right. From 2016, that probably doesn't go well with um, the nice pipeline, random pipeline that I have, and the key. Not a demo scene. Why would I need a demo scene? Come on. Just give me the key. <laughs> so let's put those items somewhere, somewhere on here for now for testing. Uh, I will get, I will put them later on where they, where they belong. Uh, somewhere. Let's put them on here. Doesn't matter. Where are they? Cobweb? No, no, no. Compositor? Deal. Deal the wrong. Prefab. There we go. That's correct. Yes, that looks good. Look at it. We can't even see it. Love it. Um, the problem here is, again, with the textures. What? Not textures model? I put it in here. I'm serious there. Uh, we need to upgrade that to the newest version. It's the same that we did earlier. So there we go. A render pipeline. Upgrade material to upgrade selected materials to high definition materials. Yes. Please, boink. This time it worked. Thank you. There we go. Yeah, we've got this deal spray. Perfect. Okay. Uh, let's make it bigger. Boink. So that's the first thing that we actually need. Let's put that now back in to download it. Boink. Next thing is the rusty key. Let me guess. The material also doesn't work. Yes. Perfect. Upgrade selected materials. Hey, this is programming, you know. That's how it works all the time. <laughs> Uh, upgrade selected materials. Yes, please proceed. This one didn't work. Autodesk? I don't need Autodesk. That's fine. If I, uh, I need the Autodesk one. Are you kidding me? Let's take the stand up. Boink. There's this key. Perfect. Love it. Got it. There we go. That's a huge S key. But okay. Uh, key go in brrr, download it and the last was the what's this the lighter yeah of course material also doesn't work guess what we do edit render pipeline upgrade I uh, cancel I selected the wrong thing that would have taken a couple of minutes if I would have pressed yes now because it would look through all the project and not just the material that I have selected. That should work because it's a standard shader. There we go. That's a small thing there. I mean, probably fine. Let's make it a bit bigger. Let's see how they just look like. I will also make them glow. Uh, but for now, let's see. I like the uplifting music. <laughs> Yeah, the problem is if I put down my camera, also the uh, my phone, the light also goes with it, of course, because you put down the phone. Um, but then we can't see things anymore as well. Uh, let's turn off the light. They look okay. They look okay. See, the chat is there now. Uh, you hooked up your C-Motion setup. Ooh. Time to get it to work. Oh, yeah, C-Motion is fun stuff. Whenever things move. Like, C-Motion is, like, a lot of movement going on. That is when it gets really fun. <laughs> so, yeah, you go. That, that's a, that, that is going to be a lot of fun. I want those to kind of glow. I, uh. I mean, what I did with the other thing is... 
to give it an emission, which is probably okay. Don't like it 100%, but it's okay-ish. Eh, it's good enough. I can outline or something would be better. Should I give it just an outline? I think I want to. Yeah, let's do it correct. Let's let's make it right. Uh, but I will need two materials. Uh, let's make it not 100% correct for now, but I'll have to fix it later. Let's also get the crowbar back into the with the other items so i actually have them all in one place and i'll see it what about some motion <laughs> tons yeah i'm planning on it but uh there's reasons i can't do it now but those items what i will do with those now it will look a bit strange. Don't get me wrong, it will look very strange. Uh, I will get all of these and unpack the prefab. Let's grab them all and let's make a new prefab. I have to make it oh, one by one, are you kidding me? <laughs> Didn't even know. The uplifting music, I just love it. <laughs> I should listen to stuff like this way more. <clears throat> uh, what I will do now is what they uh, call a pro trick. Like a pro gamer move. Oh, uh, it's all... A single and adjustable. That is actually pretty amazing. Let's do the programmer move that I talked about. Is the lighter the thing I think it is? I hope it is. Yes. Hi, Genan. <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> uh, boink. So I, I copied the lighter element of it. And I will call it lighter uh, outline. Outline something. Outline. I will just make that now bigger, just just a tad bigger. Something like this. And I will make it, give it a new material. I will give it a new material. I will give this, um, let's make a complete new material. Create uh, material new. Uh, pick up glow. I'll call that pick up glow and let's make that actually not opaque, but transparent. Uh, default, yeah, 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 that's okay, that's okay, that's okay. The base map doesn't matter. I want it green because pickups are always green. I want it to glow a little bit. Not too much, though. I don't want to have it like a, um, yeah, maybe a little bit. Let's make it stronger. It shouldn't glow. Like what I did earlier was the emission, which makes sense, but I don't want it to glow. Let's put that on the outline here. Boink. You now see this has this green outline. Uh, let's make it. Let's make it stronger. This. Let's put it. Something like that. And now it has this outline. Let's make it bigger. And that just tells us we can pick it up. And you know what? Let's give it the emission. No, nah, that's not. <laughs> um, okay, there we go. I don't want it so much. Let's make it a little bit down. That's okay. Let's get the real green thing. There we go. 
So they will all have this like a glow to it. NPC sim, I added the sim table. You have to edit in your hardware configuration. You have to have our Q0.0 in your hardware configuration. If not, it won't work. Do you have it? Oh, there. Only have the PLC. Yeah, you have to have somewhere, you have to have Q0.0 defined in your hardware configuration. That's not, that has to be. It ha has to be. Also, get this the glow. Uh, why did I give it in the pivot? Uh, pivot and center here is the same, so that's okay. So there we go. Let's give the glow. Oh, no. Let's make it like this a little bit. And like this. Ah. Let's make it bigger. It doesn't matter. Let's give that the glow. Where is it? Pick up glow. Boink. It's not perfect, but it is kind of... It is doing what I wanted to do, so that's okay. And I can activate and deactivate the glow when you are like when your cursor is on top of it. That's what I want to do in the end. Right now they just glow all the time, which is basically not useful. I mean, no, it is. It's fine. I won't change it. Body, bottom, body, boink. Yes, please. Oink. And also the crowbar. Glow. Boink. Still grayed out. I if it's still grayed out, then I don't know actually. Strange. Sounds strange. That's all I can say. It sounds strange. I always had the problem that I have not had it in the hardware setup. Huh? Why is it stretched so strange? There we go. Yeah, they all have this kind of glow now. Uh, let's turn on the... Oh, the crowbar is still <laughs> shiny. Still? As soon as it has an emission map, it's always glowing. Or what? Are you kidding me? No, not... Uh, what? What's happening? I don't understand the the uh, emission yet in uh, HDRP. I mean, let's just do this. Let's make them emit a little bit. There we go. That's fine. Ah, uh, no emission at all. Let's see how they look like. Inputs both digital and. That's why I say it's strange. Analog outputs as well. Yeah, they have to have. You have to have them in the PLC to simulate them. They have to be in there somehow. I mean, this kind of works. Let's make them really reflective. Um, now I just want to work around with the material here a little bit. Where is it? Uh, glow. I want it metallic. It should really, like, do you see that difference? It's really nice. So I want it kind of metallic, it shouldn't be too smooth. Um, there we go, tangents, but I don't care. Maybe some emission is fine, I don't know. Let's see. Why don't they turn green? It should be green now. Why are they yellow? 
Why are they yellow? I don't get it. Oh, expose! Oh, because of the exposure. Now I understand what exposure actually is. Thank you. No. Yes. No. <laughs> I don't know what nits is. I have never heard of nits. Whatever, whatever a nit is. No idea. I think low a bit. That's enough. Okay. Let's test it. Let's just see if it looks correct. For like pickups. Like those we can pick up those items. So they should not be able to see. We should not be able to see them from too far away. But if we get close we can actually already see the glow. Yeah. That looks okay. We can see them from a bit of a distance. But not too far. That looks okay. And I could check I could make it glow brighter or so when we get in there when we get close to them but no that's okay yeah okay like it I like this we are making good progress but good progress also means that I'm going to take a break because we're making good progress I didn't think I would make any progress today actually this looks nice like those the shine I like the shine yeah uh, the next part will actually be to put those in the correct places, make them really interactable, like also the, the doors and stuff, make them really interactable so that when you use them, they actually move and you actually pick those items up. Um, and once we've done that, we can actually add the monster. And then we're almost then then only dialogue and then we're done with the with this area. That sounds like easy stuff, but it's probably like 10 hours from now. <laughs> probably even more. Yeah. But good. Okay. I would say we've done a lot. I'm sorry that I couldn't help you none. It sounds it still sounds like a strange problem. Uh, maybe, maybe hop on later. I will be streaming in one and a half hours. So I'm going to take a, a break of a bit over an hour now. And then I'll be back streaming uh, Factorio. Where you can join, everyone can join the Factorio train if you want to. I think we might be finishing it today. I'm looking forward to it. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry, couldn't, couldn't really help. Um, yeah, thanks for joining on the programming trip. I hope you're in for the for the gaming trip. The 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 Factorio stream will I will still do it on YouTube, but it's one of the last streams on YouTube there, I think don't know <laughs> we'll see so so thanks for joining <laughs> and maybe see you later stay safe stay healthy nits is a candela per square meter which is the same as lumen which is strange because usually if there's light i can't just set the lumen value that's strange i will see i i don't know what it but i'll see thanks thanks pure savage i'll see i'll see about it see ya Bye-bye. Stay safe. Stay healthy. I maybe see you later. Bye-bye.